Hi kids, can you guess what's our topic now? Did you just say magnet? Awesome! In this video, we are going to talk about magnets in everyday life. I believe some of you have learned about magnet in grade 2 and 3. Do you still remember about it? Okay then, let's take a look. Hmm, what can a magnet do? Well, magnet attracts some materials to it. This magnet is attracting some nails. Object that can be attracted by magnet, we call them magnetic object. And the objects that not attracted to a magnet are non-magnetic objects. Lots of things we use in everyday life have magnets inside them. The magnets attract metal parts and keep them in place, like the magnet in door of your fridge. There are also magnetics inside the TV, the compass, speaker, and in the hospital testing machine, MRI. Okay, now we are going to see types of magnet based on the shapes. We have bar magnet. The S and N signs on the magnet stand for South Poles and North Poles. Next, the horseshoe magnet, the U-shaped magnet that looks like a horseshoe. The disc-shaped magnet, the one magnet, and the last one, the ring magnet. Okay, now we're gonna learn how to look after the magnet. Look after means taking good care of it. Well, do you know that the magnets can lose their magnetic force? If you drop the magnet, bang or hit it, especially using a hammer, or burning it, the magnet may lose the power. It means that the magnet will no longer be able to attract magnetic objects. In order to keep the magnet strong, we have to use a magnet keeper that is placed on the poles of the magnet and store them in a box. Well, that's all for now. Thank you and see you next time. Thank <music> you.